Hi, Hiram here. Yesterday I did a video where I was comparing my version 1 of the Zubatin stove burner with a version 2 of it. On the first one, just a quick recap. Basically they're just carbon felt. I wrapped it in thirds, packed into and wrapped up with aluminum foil. On the first one I cut a square hole that's about an inch square. And on the version 2, instead of a square top, I made these eight spokes. Uh, I think they were a little thin the other day, so I've widened the holes somewhat. But this is to work in the uh, Gen 2 Folding Firebox Nano. Cool little stove. It's made to work with the Trangia using these nano sticks. But I thought something like this. If you didn't see the previous videos, my thought was something like this will fit into the pouch a whole lot easier than a Trangia would. Anyway, I did a burn test yesterday comparing the two and I don't think it was real conclusive. So what I'm going to do today is a quick boil test trying to duplicate the same as I did with this. I'll use the same amount of fuel and stuff and we'll see how it works as far as boiling. So let me get some water prepped, get some alcohol or methanol in the burner and I'll be right back for a test. Okay, I have two cups of water setting at 60 degrees. I have the same amount of methanol in this as I did on the first boil test. It's 24 grams, which is about 0.64 fluid ounces. Let me light this. Okay, there we got flame. Is it going to go across? Yeah, we got flame there. So again, two cups of water at 60 degrees. And let's see how long this takes to get to a boil. We're now two minutes into the test and the temperature's up to 89 degrees, just went to 90. I think you can see it's a fairly large flame. Nice looking flame. Let me see if I can see it's fairly large down in there much bigger than the one inch square was but we'll still have to see if this gets you to a boil faster and the purpose of getting this to a boil faster is if somebody just wants to you know heat up a cup of coffee or oatmeal or something and not necessarily sit around all day there seems to be a lot of people out there that like to get <laughs> instant mashed potatoes so that's the only reason why I'm trying for a bigger flame but there we have 210, 211, 212 in 8 minutes 56 seconds. <coughs> Excuse me. Two cups of water starting at 60 degrees got to a boil in 8 minutes 56 seconds. On the other test, using the version 1, it took 8 minutes and 3 seconds. Now, not to make excuses, I'm kind of disappointed. I mean, this is a much larger flame underneath here. But, when I used version 1, when I lit it, the whole thing was up and going. On this one with the spokes, it took a while for it to get to a full flame. It had to really heat it up, I guess get it heated up and have the vapors coming out of the slots. So, on the first test, using version 1, there was a much bigger flame to start with, but now on this, as it goes, it, uh, it gets to be a much bigger flame than the first one. So, let's just see how long this runs, it goes for run out. Okay, we're now at 1633, this is the same time as what the first test went out at. Let me just take this off, you can see there's, hope you can see in the camera there's still a pretty good little flame there. So I think this means that this one was slow to take off and that's why it's still burning through now. I guess what it's saying is the fancy cut work isn't really worth the work. Maybe just make the uh, burners just like this with the square opening on the top. I had really hoped that this would cut the time down 
but consume the alcohol faster. We're almost a minute past the run out on the last one and it's still there's still flame there okay so there we go I'm gonna take it for a 1733 just like the la or a minute longer than the last one even though the flames still going but like I said I think I'm gonna take this that it's just not worth the special effort to cut slots in it rather than just this square same amount of alcohol 24 grams which is about 0.64 fluid ounces and this one the first one came to a faster boil <clears throat> okay well there it goes okay so I thank you for watching I look forward to your input questions remarks helpful suggestions and as always watch for my buddy Max bye now <laughs>